Well, hi, boys and girls. Hi, Miss Zelensky girls. here. This is Gajlak over here. <laughs> we are so happy to be joining you for our official One District, One Book School Reveal. <gasps> woo, 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 woo. Super excited. <laughs> this is our sixth. One district, one book. It's hard to believe. Six years. Holy six years gosh. of reading adventures. It is so exciting, boys and girls. And we can't wait to share with you <gasps> the winning book video. The winning. Yes. But you've got something to talk about first, Mrs. Casualak, right? Do you do. Our committee. Oh, okay. <laughs> um, well, we certainly could not do all of this without a fabulous committee behind us. And we'd like to say a huge shout out and a thank you to the following people. Of course, our principals. Mrs. Tamara Larson and Mrs. Tina Rodriguez, Mr. Andy Auer and Mrs. Alicia Crutches, PEC teachers, Carrie Schmidt, Miranda Schultz, Leah Katib, Leah Jasek, and Nicole Sandretto. Parents, Julie Donnelly, thank yes. you so much <laughs> for all the footwork that you do to get this done. So much. <laughs> um, our IEC teachers, yep. Lindsay Dordery, Julia Stevener, Dina Peterson, Sue Black, and Joy Katib. And of course, our middle school teachers, yes. Amy Golden and Camille Pleba. And really they, holding down the fort at the middle they school. They are holding down that yes, fort. Yes, they are with our sixth graders. And then we have our libraries, of course, our yeah. Youngstown, Lewis, and Aransville libraries. So Sonora Miller and Ann Sejaka and <laughs> Phila Iba. Yes. Thank you so much for everything that you do in your libraries to help us in our libraries. It's a great team effort. Such a great team effort. And we're so fortunate to have three libraries in our school community. I mean, we are just super, super um, blessed to have that right here in our school community. So, I think what everyone's been waiting for now. What? What are we waiting well, for? Well, we want to find out Is the winning book. Snack? We want to find out the winning book. Is that time it's, for snack? Because look it. Is it recess? <laughs> Not yet. We have the last of the really great Wayne Doodles or Jeremy Thatcher, Dragon Hatcher. Now, both cannot win, boys and girls. They can't? They can't. So oh. no crying, no tears if the book you voted for didn't win. You can always still read whichever book doesn't win. Absolutely. Yeah. I've got a couple of copies in my library. Uh, I've got a couple of copies in mine, and I know that our local libraries, Lewiston, Youngstown, and Ransomville, also have copies in of their libraries. Books, of both right? books. You got it. So, here's here's our video. Are you ready? Drum ready? roll. Wherever you are, you can do a little drum roll on your knees, because here we go. This is our revealing video. <laughs> With a total of 930 votes. And the winning book had 496 votes. We waited. But now it's time to reveal the winning book. Let the countdown begin. Ten! Yes! Nine! Eight, seven, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. He's such a good. He's such a good. And the winning book is the last of the really great games. Happy reading, Lukeport. Let the reading adventure begin. Wow, there you have it! Woohoo! This year's One District, One Book winner is the last of the really great Wang Doodles. And guess what? Today, 
you get your very own free copy of the book to keep forever and ever. They have your names on them already. And you'll get those today along with some very important things. So take a look. Mrs. Kajak, you want to tell them about our bookmark here? Absolutely. Boys and girls, inside of all of the books, you will find this bookmark, which is going to come in handy for you because it has that little QR code on yeah. it. See it right there. <laughs> You're going to use that to scan and that will take you right to our website where you can read along with our guest readers for the next six weeks. Yeah, you got it. And there's also uh, links on that for that very QR code. Um, on there you'll also see fun websites and you'll also see links to those trivia questions. Now, one other very important thing that you're going to get today, boys and girls, it's very important to share with your families at home. There will be a welcome letter in a packet and in it, it has a welcome letter from our principals and gives your mom and dad, grandma, grandpa, some information about um, what is One District, One Book. And the important part, of course, because the fun is just starting now, right? The fun is just starting. We get to read, over the next six weeks, we get to read this book all together. At home with our families, uh, you'll be able to listen to it. And so here's our reading schedule. And each week and on our reading schedule, it has uh, what week it is, what pages you'll be reading until. And most importantly, it's got some questions to really talk about with your family. And in there is hidden a trivia question. A trivia a question. A trivia question where you can win prizes. And we'll talk about that in just a minute. Okay. Prizes? prizes? Can you believe it? And so there's two pages there of the reading schedule. And, of course, it ends on March 3rd. And Friday, March 4th is our family, uh, family night reading celebration and so more details to come about that and also in that packet very important we have 35 businesses around town partnering with us this year and if you take a look let me see Boop. if you can see that logo right there where it says proud supporter of the one district one book creating a community of readers watch for that around town because, like we said, 35 businesses are participating this year as our community business partners. And there'll be scavenger hunts at those businesses, all kinds of specials like Tim Hortons and Lewiston. You mentioned the book, you get a free donut. Subway, same thing, you get a free cookie. Uh, there's all these great specials that you can uh, be a part of. So make sure that you show mom and dad, grandma, grandpa, um, all about those different business partners. And on the last page of that packet, just a little information for families on some tips for reading out loud at home. And so like we mentioned, prizes, prizes. Mrs. Gajlak, prizes. It's all about the prizes. All about the prizes. And a good book. And course. a good book. Every Friday, boys and girls, on Seesaw, you're going to look for this. And we're going to post it, and also on Google Classroom for our sixth graders. And every week, we're going to give you this uh, update on Fridays, and it tells you who our guest readers are. <gasps> We're revealing them right now. So our first guest readers this, this week, Mrs. Larson, Mrs. Rodriguez, and Mr. Auer. And there's, there might be a few surprise guests on some of those readers, so we'll have to check those out. Scavenger Hunt this week, it starts at Lewiston Love. And what's super awesome is they are in partnership with Nickel City Woodworking. And we'll show you that in just a minute. Um, and also, it tells us what this week's trivia question is. So, what was painted all over the professor's clear plastic umbrella? Well, you're reading this week be thinking about that mm. and right there there are links to the PEC trivia IEC trivia and the middle school trivia and so question is announced on Friday you have a whole week to answer until next Thursday and then on Friday we announce winners at both the middle school IEC and at the PEC so tune into news on Friday whoop, whoop. lots of prizes to give away and we mentioned that Nickel City woodworking paint kit <gasps> Aren't they awesome? Super cool. For $10, <laughs> this fabulous paint kit. And part of that actually uh, goes back, and Mrs. Cashluck will tell you about that in one second. <gasps> Scavenger hunts. So the first one is at Lewiston Love. Your job is to go and find a wang doodle. And when you find the wang doodle, you'll let the people at Lewiston Love know. They'll give you this ticket right here. You put your name on it, bring it back to the PEC library, IEC library, or middle school library. <gasps> You win more prizes. Win more prizes. Lots of prizes. We're all about the prizes this year. And so we mentioned that this woodworking kit, they're $10, and a portion of those proceeds go to a very special place. And Mrs. Kajlak's going to tell you about that right now. So every year when we do One District, One Book, we like yeah. to give back to our community. And a few years ago, we gave back to the Primate Sanctuary. Yes. And we did the one and only Ivan. Yes. And then last year, it was the SPCA that we were able to give back to. Yeah. And this year... 
we're giving back to the Youngstown Volunteer Fire Company. Um, so any proceeds that we make off of the, the paint kits or other things that are going on around the community, um, we're going to donate that to the Youngstown Volunteer Fire Company because they're having an equipment drive and that equipment costs a lot of money. And helmets, a boots. Lot to keep our community safe. Yeah, so absolutely. we're going to say thank you by donating to their cause. I love that. Nothing better than giving back, right? Well, there you have it, boys and girls. So much great information. We are excited to go on this reading adventure with you with the last of the really great Wang Doodles. <gasps> Super what excited! Wang Doodle? I don't know! Anyway. We're going to find out. <laughs> Thank you, everyone, for tuning in. Bye. Enjoy Happy that reading. book. Happy reading. <laughs>